Greetings, Dennis Daniels here. This is a super basic demonstration of how to uh, open um, a file, write to it, and close it in Python. Uh, in this instance, or rather in this um, program, I've been importing math and then my file open. And we know how to do that because if we go to the interactive and we type open, if you hit the tab key, nothing happens. You hit the dot, you know, the period, and now hit tab, and you get all kinds of methods against that um, against that data type. I think it's a data type, or is it a function? Um, and then, if you hit the parentheses, then you'll get the instructions on what is supposed to happen. So in this case, file, and then the mode in this instance is R. Um, buffering, <coughs> encoding. I'm not quite sure what those last two are. I'm pretty sure this is read. Um, so, looking at this one, though, I've got the the full path. You need the full path. It's opening this file. <coughs> In fact, I'm going to change that. I'm going to give it a new name. And I'm not quite sure what A is. What is A? Um, change that so we don't confuse everybody. What is the A value? Uh, and then for X and range, um, we'll 50, why not? We're making a little number machine. A little number machine. <coughs> and then print. This is what's going to be print in the into the file. X um, and then X divided by math.py. And just for giggles, we can do x times yeah uh, yeah why not x squared times x over math pi and then f5 to run it and hopefully we won't get any errors. F5 to run. No complaints. Now we go to the desktop, and now I should have my magical file C, and my number machine output is here, and here's my number machine. So I've got 50, right down here, yeah, I got 50 numbers, 50 pairs of numbers, and they're all right here. Uh, so if I wanted to do if I wanted to do some graphing or whatnot, this would definitely be a good first step. Um, and here's the code, very basic, but I uh, wanted to uh, give my thanks out to Stack Overflow um, for the inspiration and for the code. Thanks for watching and happy computing.